Teachers in Mobile County have been back in the classroom since last week. Well, today they welcomed the students back. The first day of school on this side of the bay now in the books as Baldwin County Public Schools head back tomorrow. Let's go! Parents packing extra patients this morning. Back to school traffic and the drop off line can be a challenge. The students unfazed by it all. No first day jitters here. What are you looking forward to? School. <laughs> what is it about school that you're looking forward to? Like meeting the teachers, like getting to know kids and learning. <laughs> On this first day back, Mobile County Public School Superintendent Cressel Threadgill not only making the rounds, but also sitting in class with students. Everybody's ready for a brand new year. The 2024-25 school year comes with a new commitment and policy surrounding safety. The Mobile County Public School System investing in advanced weapon detection systems. The goal to keep guns and other weapons off campus. Safety is the number one uh, important thing in a school system. The students and the faculty and staff should feel very, very safe. And our goal is to do everything possible to make sure that that happens. Students in Baldwin County Public Schools head back to class tomorrow. Safety preps have also been underway there. School resource officers with the Baldwin County Sheriff's Office are ready to go. While routines may be hard to fall back into, the teachers can't wait to educate and engage these young minds. At Chestang Fournier, they can expect excellent instruction. That's our focus. We're soaring to greater heights, and we want them to know that we are a partnership. And any student, whatever deficit, we're going to address that deficit and ensure that child gets a quality education. Here's to keeping that momentum and first day attitude all year long. Every first day of school is so wonderful, so full of energy. Our teachers and staff have been working so very hard. Again, Baldwin County Public Schools start tomorrow. School officials tell me they are asking drivers to be patient, especially in the car lines with first time parents and students. They say it usually takes about a week for everyone to fall into a rhythm.